Hello everyone and welcome to Little Red. My name is Melanie V. Thanks for joining me today. Okay, so this is episode number three. And for some strange reason, episode two, the audio felt the need to not record. I had no control whatsoever over it. I, hopefully this one is recording. <laughs> but let's get started on day 15 of spring. And we still have uh, some personal goals to achieve for this second goal. We need to collect 10 stones. We've collected three so far. But on the last episode, we got to meet Lilith for the first time. And I didn't get to build her a house as yet. Or did I build her the house? I think I was still working on getting her her house. Oh no, I did finish it. Yay, Lilith has a home. Let's say hello to Lilith. Hey, Melanie B, I'm deciding which spell to master next. Should I try out Dark Beam of Death or Apocalypse Meteor Shower? Uh, they both kind of sound dangerous. So let's go into her house. And I think I needed to build a desk for everyone's house so I can know what they like. So let's go into the build mode and build Lilith a desk. Huh, I don't see the desk on here. You would think it would be like an essential. Are they called desks? Hmm. Well, there it is. Why didn't I see that before? A desk for Lilith. Now we can see what she actually needs. So she wants a bunch of things. We want a wizard's staircase wallpaper. Oh boy. Well, maybe let's go work on some of the other residents first. Well, that seems a little bit difficult. Okay, let's go check in with Bubsy. Hey, Bubsy. Hello, Melanie B. I have an important question for you. Which town folk do you find the most beautiful? I'll let you think about your answer carefully. Alright, I guess he thinks it's him probably. <laughs> then we'll say hello to Laura. Who is this person? Have I met this person before? I don't remember her. My notebook? I just had it in my bag. How could I have misplaced it? All of my precious records in there. It's not here on the ground. Maybe I dropped it over there. Maybe I... Oh, hello. Sorry, I didn't see you there. I get lost in thought sometimes. I'm Laura. I'm a researcher of everything in Solemn. As you probably overheard, I've misplaced my notebook. If you see one laying around, please let me know. I'll be back later. I'm going to take one more look in the forest. Okay, okay, so she's a new character. Okay. I'm just going to quickly change my sound options. There we go. And let's check out our mailbox. What did we get? Dalton sent us a moth. A mighty moth. Very nice. Thanks, Dalton. And Lilith sent us a gobble nuke. Cool. And we've got a plain brick from Willow. All very much appreciated. Let's go say hello to Willow. Hey, Willow. You can use dirt to place dirt birds around town while in build mode. I think they make little wood look pretty. Good suggestion. Also, if you place dirt rows on the bottom side of a cliff, you will create stairs. Got it. And let's see, Dudley, what's he up to? 
Okay, are you ready, Melanie V? Here's my blueprint that I have been working on. Got a coffee shop. Nice. Where are we going to place this coffee shop, though? Okay, let's go over to our shopping center and collect our money. Got a bit of dewdrop. And let's put out some more items. Um, what should we put out this time? Put out some fish. Since we have a lot of fish. I'm glad the people buy whatever I put out. <laughs> and we'll do a little fishing here. And we got back one of the minnows we just put for sale. And there's a little butterfly over here. We'll go catch that. Is there anything else that we found? Oh, there's some more fish. A little fishy. Huh? I think I found a rare fish. <gasps> what? Nice. I like rare fishes. I think I do. And let's go catch another fish fish right here. Fishing in this game is super easy and I like that. Okay, maybe we'll jump on the air balloon and go over to the quarry maybe and collect some rocks. We still need to collect seven. So yeah, let's head over to the airship. So we'll go to the dust cavern, and hopefully we don't get attacked by anything. Okay, so we can go into the first level of the mine, it looks like. What? Is there... Is, were there always monsters? <laughs> Do I have any weapons to fend for myself? Ah! Okay, so they can attack you, it looks like. But I think I've completed now my goals, my personal goals. And I caught a minnow. Let's catch some of these bugs in here. I wonder what I need to, like take out those monsters. So let's harvest all the rocks that we can. So those are special rocks. Oh! It got me. So they do attack you. Well, that's unfortunate. What are these items? Are these items for sale? Purple sludge. No, thank you. Um, light fairy. Ooh, know what that does. And as a Luca coin. Doesn't seem to take dew drops though. Okay, well, let's head back. Maybe we can go to the endless forest for a little bit. Let's get on this little critter here. These whirly gigs are pretty cool. I'm gonna try to find as much magic one as I can first. Ah, uh, it's getting late. Do I wanna pass out here? Not really. I mean, I can, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, I'll catch this fish. I won't catch that fish. Let's chop down another tree, and we can probably call it a night soon. And there we go, we're past that. 
but we leveled up with everyone and we have a new friend, Laura. And our merchant in level went up. Perfect. Now day 16 of spring. So let's head back into the forest. Let's get some more wood. We won't spend too long this time though. It's just a different fruit tree. I need level 10 to get that fruit tree. Okay. That's okay. We'll grab some weed. And uh, we got some dirt from that one. What was that? Grassy earth. Interesting. We'll catch this bug. Okay, is there any more magic wood to be found here? Oh, what's this tree? Is it a bad tree? I don't want to talk to it, just in case. I don't want it to attack me. Ah, seriously? I was just minding my own business, and it attacked me. Okay, let's go back to the dust cavern for a little bit. And who's this person back here? How do I get to them? Can I go around? Let's see who this person is. Toad. Hello. Hello there. I'm Master Minor Toad, or as some people like to call me, the Toad. Okay? Be careful in the dust cavern. You don't want to get whomped. I don't, but how do I avoid getting whomped? Okay, so I can't open these chests because it's sealed by magic. So let's head into the mines. Where am I? Okay. Listen, little creatures, please do not attack me. I am just minding my own business, collecting some rock, peacefully trying to collect some rock. Okay, let's head back to town. Maybe we can say hello to some of our townsfolk. Oh, how do we get out of here again? Oh, right, leave caverns. And we'll head back to Little Wood since we spent the night away. And yeah, we'll collect some of this dew drops here. Maybe we'll set some more items out. See if anybody buys anything. Even though it's pretty late. Okay. And a traveler brings gift. That's the ice mage. Ooh, what do you bring? We got a bubble spell. We can do magic. Hello, Willow. Hi, Melanie V. I'm super excited to celebrate town events here in Littlewood. When you get a chance, try building that town square. Yeah, uh, I don't even know where to put that. Where would I put the town square? Maybe I can put it like right here, since there's a little bit of space. Let's give it a try. Let's go into build mode. And we want to build a structure. Oh, there's a couple of structures I need to build. A coffee shop, so I guess we'll do the town square first, if we can fit it. No, we can't really fit it here. I wonder if there's like some way to like kind of clear these mountainous areas. Oh, where can we place this town square? It's almost should be in the center of town, but I can't fit it in the center of town. It's a humongous zone. Maybe I can move a 
Dalton's house. And we can be neighbors. Dalton, me and you are now best buds. Can you get in his house that way though? Maybe we can't be neighbors. How would I access his doorway if it's there? That's not gonna work. What about right here? Yeah, let's put that, his house right there. Now let's see if we can't fit the town square. What, it doesn't fit here either. Maybe I'll have to move someone else's house. Let's move Bubsy. We'll move both Bubsy and uh, Willow's house up here, maybe. They could be neighbors. I think they will get along just fine. There you go. I wonder if I can put dolphins here, too. Yeah, if I place it here, I won't be able to access. The layout of this the town so far is kind of odd. So I don't know if I can like maybe break down some of these mountainous areas or not. That's something I can do eventually, but let's try one more time. Town Square, please. Right here. There we go, finally. Now, where can we place this coffee shop? Well, at least the coffee shop is a reasonable size, so let's place it right there. Okay, and what is this? Okay, so we got two items placed. And let's go say hello to Willow before the night's over. Hey, Willow. Did you know that trees will regrow from stumps in town? Unless they are burned to ashes. What? Don't burn the trees down, please. Well, that might make some coal. Let's catch this little fishy. Or not. Let's chase that little fishy away. Okay, well, let's go ahead and head to bed. I didn't actually check out the new coffee shop yet, though. Oh! Is Gobby running the coffee shop? Oh, I can buy things from him. A nutty cocoa, bitter brew, candy brew. Everything is free. Fluffy berry vanilla cake. Mmm, those sound delicious. Okay, well, we'll have to come back and check those out. Oh, and there's that book. So maybe this is Lauren's book over here. Let's check it out. Yes. So once Laura is back, we can probably give her that book. But we passed out for today. But we gained some friendship with Lilith. And our merchant skill went up a couple times. Nice. Wednesday, day 17 of spring. I didn't feel sleep well last night because I slept in the dirt. Note to self, try to go to bed. <laughs> And there's Laura. Let's give her her book back. Hey, Laura. Sigh. I couldn't find it. <laughs> Looks like she has some uh, leaves in her hair. I climbed on trees, crawled through caves. I even fell into a... Is that my notebook? You found it. All of my notes and research fully recovered right here in... Oh. Oh, no. It's unreadable. All of the pages are soaking wet. It looks like I'm going to have to start all over. Oh no! Great, what if you helped me with my research? If we work together, we can record our findings twice as fast. It's settled. I'm moving into your town. Okay, sure. Where are we going to place her house though? 
Let's go check out our new town, Square Area. Cool water. By the fountain. And Bubsy's hanging out here. Did you know you can speak spark a romance with any of the townsfolk? You're the hero of Solemn, Solemn after all. Who wouldn't want to fuck your feathers? I'm surprisingly single. But I'm ready to mingle. Good for you, not interested. <laughs> hey Dalton. Hey Melanie B. I just wanted to tell you something very important. I'm leaving Littlewood forever. What? Ha! You should have seen the look on your face. I'm not going anywhere. But I do have important news. I'm going to restock my shop every day now, instead of just Tuesdays and Thursdays. See, I didn't even know you were restocking it on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So I'm glad you're restocking it every day. And I've got some slime apples. And let's go say hello to Willow. I think Willow is be the one I'd be most interested in sparking any relationships with. She's the most useful person in town. Want to know what my perfect day looks like? Drink a cup of coffee, go for a jog, chop some wood, then study blueprints. Having a daily routine keeps my mind fresh and focused. I'd love to hear all about your daily routine too. I don't really have a daily routine. But I think I'm gonna like go ahead and place some um, a desk in each of these uh, villagers' house. So let's go into build mode. Was it under essentials? Uh, okay, decorative. Here is a desk for my friend Willow. And we'll see what she wants. I wish my house was within 16 spaces of Melanie Lee's house. And it is. That's great. <laughs> and she wants elf with wallpaper. I want a dainty table. I want a book. She, holy, she wants a lot of stuff. But we are 13% completed. Let's see what else we can get for her. I don't think I have a whole lot of options so far. Yeah, I don't have any wallpaper. And the bed. Did she say what type of bed she wants? Oh, wait, there was something under decorative. Oh, it's a spell. So, let me check out her request one more time. A dainty table, a bookshelf, green carpet, and elfwood wallpaper. I don't have any of those things. So, I can't help you out below. Um, let's get... Um, a desk for Bubsy. And we'll place this right here. And maybe we can get some things made for Bubsy. Contemporary wallpaper. I wish my house was within 16 spaces of the tavern. Um, not right now. <laughs> okay, so... I have a ways to go on all of these people's houses, it looks like. Let's go check the mail. Got four letters, holy! Got a letter from Dudley, got a plain brick, a heroic merit from Dudley. Those copies sure are cute. One came up to me this morning and gave me a fish. What a nice fellow. What does the heroic merit do? Okay, we've got some dewdrops from Lilith. Thanks, Lilith. And some dewdrops from Bugsy as well. Thanks, guys. And let's collect these over here. And who's this? A traveler. I love the travelers, Lelena. So now I have a sack of goods. So this is for like decorations. That's pretty cool. Let's put some more items out for sale. I have a lot of clutter buys. So we'll sell those. And let's catch a couple more. 
and we'll catch this little fishy here. Oh, and another flutterby appeared. Okay, it's not actually a flutterby, I suppose. Okay, should we go check out the coffee shop? Let's go see how Willow's doing. Hey, Willow. Okay, this morning I made more progress with controlling my magical abilities. Here, I'll show you this whole new spell. What? Now it's not going to work? Grr. That's frustrating. Well, better luck next time. Okay, so I'm going to actually try going into build mode and see if I can destroy these. I can! Yes! So let's clear this area up so I can actually place more housing around here. Okay, and maybe can we move this? This is fantastic. I like this feature for sure. <laughs> Definitely will make the town more navigatable. Okay. So let's... Uh, actually, I want to go back into build mode. Let's move Dudley's house closer to the cavern. So we'll move this. Maybe right here. And we'll move this shop over here. That way we can put Dudley's house there. Let's place this right here for now. We'll definitely have to do more decorating later. And let's go ahead and grab... Now this is Willow's house. Let's move the Bubsy's. Not Dudley's. Did I say Dudley? I meant Bubsy's house. So that should be close enough to the tavern. And let's make Willow our, our neighbor. Oops, let's go back into build mode again. So I'll move my house right next to hers. That should make her happy. And we know we were already close enough. Now we are closest neighbors. So let's go check in Bubsy's house now. So we got one more task complete for him. Very nice. Okay. And let's visit with Dudley. Hey, Dudley. Hey Melanie B, since you're the hero of Solemn, your first purchase at the coffee shop is free every day. Don't forget to start your mornings right by stopping by. Oh, so it's just the first cup per day, which is pretty generous, I suppose. Um, we'll take a coffee. The Nutty Cocoa, I wonder what if they have different effects. I think I will try this hazel brew. Okay, so it does have some sort of wood cutting effect. Very nice. So let's actually go use, make use of that wood cutting effect. And we'll head over to the endless forest. There we go. Let's jump in a whirly gig. So is it giving me more experience, I wonder? Let's get this magic wood. I'm just gonna, gonna focus on the magic wood, I suppose. There's some more over here. Ah, oh, there's a, got attacked by trees. Why do the trees keep attacking me? 
Okay, let's head into the cavern. Okay. There are creatures in the cavern. Please. Oh! Who's that? Ash. Hey, you there. Could you lend me a hand? These wampers are trying to eat me. I dropped my whistle over there. Grab it and blow it. Um, is it in this chest? No, that's some dew drops. Where's his whistle? Ah, there it is. Get away from him, baddies. Phew. That was a close one. Thanks a lot for helping me out there. The name's Ash. I'm a dust miner. Huh, Melanie V? Isn't that the name of the hero of Solemn? Whoa, you're the hero. Right on. It's an honor to meet you, Melanie V. I'll have to be more careful down here from now on. I can't keep counting on being saved by a hero. I've got to repay you somehow for helping me out. You live in Littlewood, right? Everyone's always talking about that place. I'll come visit sometime. I'll bring you a nice present. Oh, thanks, bud. Okay, let's go ahead and collect some of these goodies in here. And it's getting pretty late. I probably should head back to town though. Just cause I do want to go ahead and get Laura's house started. I don't think I did that at the end. Or did I? No, I didn't. I didn't build her a house. So back to little wood we'll go. So um, I think I need to get some of these mountainous areas cleared. But is that gonna take any of my my time? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, perfect. I don't know if Laura wants to live over here by the ear balloon. Probably not. But now that I have more space, maybe I can move the town square down here instead. I don't know, it kind of feels like a more appropriate place for the town square, but also it doesn't either. The town square should probably be in the center of town. Okay, let's clear up this area here. We'll just place our house down here for now. I mean, this can be moved, right? Okay. So, we'll place a new building. And there's Laura's house. I don't have enough plain brick, what? I wonder if I can go make some bricks right now. No. And here we make the bricks. Oh no! I got tired from making bricks. So we didn't get to make Laura's house today, but we'll do it on Thursday. So we've got our emergency skills up. Okay, overall our levels aren't too bad, I suppose. But it's now day 18 on Thursday. So we'll make some more bricks since we kind of just fell asleep here. That should be good. And we've got some fancy bricks as well. Can I collect any of these items in here? No, it looks like because I didn't get enough rest last night, I'm really tired already. I'll collect our dew drops. What should we put out for sale? Um, I'll sell a few of my fish, and let's sell some more flutterbys, and we'll sell a dragon's wasp, 
for two. There we go. And we'll collect the mail. Two pieces of mail. So we got a perfect plank from Bubsy. Oh, that's nice. And some dewdrops from Willow. Thanks, Willow. Okay, so let's go ahead and make Laura's house now. I'll still place it right over here. Okay. Laura's house done. And I'll head in there and see if she's there. Here she comes. Hey, Laura. Wow, it's really cozy in here. Thanks for letting me stay in Littlewood. We're going to learn so much together. I'm glad to hear it. It's not really cozy yet, but it will get there. Let's go ahead and make her a desk and see what kind of stuff she likes. Okay. So she wants a teacup bed. I wish my house was within 16 spaces of the museum. We don't have a museum yet. Okay, we'll have to keep that in mind when we're making the museum. I haven't been to my house in a while. <laughs> Let's visit with some more of the residents, though. Oh, I just want to say hello. Hey, Ash. Hey, Melanie B. I decided to stop by and check out Littlewood. The stories are true. This really is a beautiful town. Oh, before I forget, here's a present for you for saving me back in the caverns. A silver glove? What does that do? Cool, thanks. Collect some of these weeds over here. And we'll say hello to Willow. Hey, Willow. I bought a few items Dalton, at Dalton's general shop this morning. I'm going to try mixing them and making a powerful potion. Uh, good luck with that. Hopefully you don't blow up anything. Uh, it's getting pretty late. Maybe we should grab some coffee. Hey, Gobby, let's get the nutty cocoa. What does that do? Oh, looks like it helps with mining. Probably not going to do any mining today, though. Hey, Bubsy, people always compliment me on my purple scarf. It's fuchsia, not purple. How dare they? Let's go say hello to Dalton. Do you remember when that bridge collapsed under our feet? We were really high up in the sludgery mountains. Oh, the sludgy mountains. On our way to the dark wizard. You caught my hand at the last second. You saved my life. Well, you're welcome. I'll go see Dudley. Hey, Dudley. Oh, I forgot to give this to you yesterday. It is a hand-me-down blueprint for my great-grandpa. A nightstand. Nice. I will take it. And there's some slime apple back here. I'm going to go ahead and collect it. And then we need to go say hello to Willow. And I think I'm going to give her a compliment so we can get our friendship up even faster. Oh, who's this guy down here? Hello. Gobby Traveler. Waga Shoggy. Sure. Oh, he gave me two plumberries. Thanks, guy. Hey, Willow. Hey, so you don't remember anything from before. You defeated the dark wizard. Your favorite color, your favorite food, your favorite friend. I think you might have been my favorite friend. Let's give her a compliment. You really know how to make me feel good. <laughs> Glad to hear it. And, oh, it looks like our crops are ready for harvesting um i'm gonna collect like those it's taking my energy though oh boy i wanted to go check out dalton's shop before the night was over just because he says it changes daily now is this a shop I uh, know this is where I make food. Where is Dalton's shop? Ah, 
What is this? A rose lamp. Ooh, I would like to purchase that. But it's really pricey. I can purchase some wood. No, thank you. A plain table. I think I probably already have a plain table. Or maybe I can even make a plain table. I'm not sure. Okay, so I think I'm going to try just going to bed and so we can actually get some rest. Oh, my house has moved. Right, I moved next to Willow. And which one's mine? This one's mine. Okay, bedtime. Finally some sleep in a real bed. And we're making some good progress with everyone it looks like. Crafting levels gone up. Did I not put anything for sale? Oh, I did. Just not enough money was made. It is now Friday, day 19. Willow's secret? Willow? Huh? Oh, hey Dalton. Can you believe it? Melanie B is alive after all. Our fight with the Dark Wizard was so awesome. You shot him with a bunch of arrows. I threw my cool ninja shurikens. And Melanie B got the last hit with the legendary magic sword. But I think I remember Melanie V fading away with the Dark Wizard. Yeah, my memory is a little hazy about that part too. They both seem to just disappear. I thought Melanie V was gone forever until I found her in the forest. Yeah, I cried every night until I got your letter. Melanie V was like my best friend. So Melanie V really can't remember anything, huh? It seems that memory really was taken away by that dark wizard. Well, are you gonna tell her about... I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, Willow. So Willow has a secret I have to discover, I guess. And we're finally in our house, so we've got another personal goal completed. Personal goal number two. So what do we have to do next? Sell 10 items at the marketplace, cook 10 dishes at the tavern, collect 10 plumberries, and collect 10 carrots. Okay. We'll work on those things. Hey, below. Oh my goodness. Last night I tried the slime pudding at the tavern. It was the most delicious thing I've ever eaten. Ah, good to know. You're so sweet, Melanie V. And gave her a compliment. And there's a treasure chest here. Got 52 drops. Nice. And we'll harvest that weed and catch this butterfly. Let's check our mail. Just one piece today. 100 dewdrops from Dalton. And who's this person over here? Another traveler. We'll take the gift. This is Donna the Fighter. And I got a Womper Pet Blueprint. Okay, cool. Let's put some more items for sale. What are we going to put? Let's sell some of these. We'll sell some slime apples. And we'll sell some carrots. We'll sell one sour puck. And a plumberry. What else should we sell? Um, let's sell some of these flutterbys. Okay, let's see who this person is. It's Ash. Hey there again. You know, ever since we met, I kind of wanted to get to know you more. I just had to come back here to ask you something. Do you think I can stay here and help you rebuild the Lovewood? My home near the dust cabin is rather dusty. And besides, I can get I can help gather building materials. We can also hang out more. I can take you on a date. Huh? I said we can hang out more and that little wood is great. <laughs> okay, so we got a blueprint for Ash's house. I think Ash has a little interest in us. We'll say hello to Laura. Hey, Laura. Hmm, yes. Slime apples are plump and juicy, while peach are tangy and tart. Oh, hey there, Melanie. 
I was just writing down some new research on the fruits of Solemn. Cool. Okay, let's catch this little fish right here. Okay. There's another flutterby right here. I don't know if it's actually a flutterby. I always call them flutterby. But it can be anything, really. I wonder if I can take down these fencing as well. Let's go into build mode and check it out. Oh, I can! Yes! This is fantastic. And I'm collecting wood from it as well. That is even better. I'll have to put these up again. But I don't think I'm going to focus on decorating too much just yet. Let's get all of these cleared. I'm getting a lot of wood for free. So I gotta appreciate that. What about these? Collect the red zigzag. What? Collect a lollipop. I didn't know I can do that. Very cool. Stew cap. I'll take that. I shouldn't destroy all of these, should I? So now, do I, am I able to place these down someplace else? That would be nice if I could. What about this tree? I don't want to destroy the tree now. Okay. And maybe I'll clear this area over here. Make a little bit more space. Definitely get this area opened up a bit more. So now we should be able to place the house for Ash around here, maybe. Oh, oops, didn't mean to put that there. <laughs> I guess I did. Okay, can I adjust the water? What can I do here? I can extend the water. Okay, cool. And I'll collect this dew cap over here. And I think I'll remove Lilith's house. We'll place it back here. It's a little bit more accessible. And let's destroy some of this mountain lake area. Okay, yeah, I think that looks good. Let's get one more room. Okay, so a lot more space is opened up. And I'll collect these dirt pads. So the town isn't nearly as scenic, but I think we will get there eventually. Let's collect this. We'll say hi to Dudley. Hey Dudley. Hey Melody Me. Did you know that if you leave trees done, the trees will grow back? It's super useful to have regrowing trees here in town for extra wood. Yeah, I wish I knew that before before I destroyed them all. <laughs> but now we can create tree stumps. Oh, wonderful. Thanks, Dudley. Did I put a I didn't put a desk in his house yet? So let's go ahead and build him a desk. And let's see what we can make for him. I want a ship's hull wallpaper. I wish my house was within 16 spaces of the coffee shop. Okay, we want some interesting things. None of what I can supply right now. And I'll say hello to Bubsy. Yesterday, Dalton tried my plumberry fizz. Can you believe he said it was just good? Some people lack sophistication. That's your opinion, okay. 
and I think maybe we'll head back over to the endless forest. Okay, let's jump on our whirly gig. So, ah, once that thing is awake, things randomly attack you. So you have to make sure those things aren't awake when you're like traveling around. Okay, well, I kind of learned something new. Um, can we get out of here? Let's go into the caverns. And I don't want to upgrade anything yet. Ooh, a treasure. Got some dew drops. Okay, got some grassy earth from that thing. So I wonder if I can fight these monsters off. I should probably head back so I can get to bed though. I'll just leave caverns and hop on the air balloon. I hope I spoke to everyone in town today. Talk to Laura, yes, and Bubsy, I think I spoke to Willow. Did I talk to Willow? Let's just double check. Hello, Willow. I saw Dolphin throwing slime apples at Willow. That doesn't seem very nice. Perhaps I should throw a small fireball of destruction at him? No, you, you shouldn't do that. That is... A little bit excessive. Okay, we talked to Bubsy. And make sure to talk to Willow. Let's talk to her again. I want to try every dish at Littlewood's Tavern. Okay, to bed we go. When we'll get a good night's sleep, we're leveled up with Willow. Nice. And we leveled up our gathering. And our merchanting, merchanting. And now it's day 20 of spring, Saturday. So we're getting a fishing lesson from, from Dalton? That must be from Dudley. Hey, Dad. Good morning, Dalton. How are you doing today? I'm doing great, except uh, I can't catch any fish. Well, are you throwing out your line properly? Yeah, I'm throwing it right on top of them, but the fish either swim away or float around like they feel, fell asleep. Dalton, you must cast your line out next to the fish, not right on top of them. Then wait for the fish to come to you. Once your bubble goes under the water, you reel them in. Oh, I knew that already though. And I am feeling optimistic today. And let's say hello to our friend, Willow. Hey, Willow. Okay, I definitely saw something standing at the edge of the woods last night. It looked like a creepy ghost creature. Uh, that's not good. And a compliment for her. No way, my hair is not pretty today. You're so nice, Melanie. Okay, and um, we'll collect this weed and some slime apple. And check our mail. Got a letter from Laura, 100 G drops. Thanks, Laura. And we got heroic merit. Nice. Let's see how much money we collected. 108 G drops, and who's this? Oh, it's Lilith. What are you doing over here? Hey, Melanie B. Dudley has been teaching me some neat meditation tricks. Now, wherever I get, whenever I get upset, I can calm down by. A bug just flew in my mouth. That's gross. And we'll catch this flutterby or bug. And it's a dragon's wasp. We'll put it for sale. And 
sell some bugs. I'm running out of things to sell. Uh, let's sell some wheat. Why not? And let's try to catch this little fish over here. Got it. And we'll have a quick hello to Laura. Melanie V. This morning I had an amazing idea. You see, I've been writing all of my findings in my small notebook. It's just words. Words are boring. If I want to share my research with the people of Solemn, I need something eye-catching. Get your tools ready, Melanie P. We're going to build the greatest museum in all of Solemn. Yes, we got their blueprint for the museum. So we'll put it close by her house. So let's go into build mode. I am actually going to move this air balloon station over here. And that way we can... Let's destroy this thing. That way we can put the museum right next to Laura's house. So museum, check. Is there something else we can build? Whose house is that? Oh, I didn't build a house for ashes yet, but I need more wooden plank. Okay. So we'll have to get on that. Let's check out the museum. Melanie B, I was talking to Willa this morning and she said you're the hero of Solemn. Don't you think you should have told me something that important? Wow, this museum looks great, by the way. Okay then, hero, it's time for your next big quest. Donating, donating one of every item that exists in Solemn to our museum. Together, we will build Solemn's greatest treasure trove of information. Whoa. Okay. So I need to upgrade the museum. Let's go upstairs. What? What's in here? Crop room. So I've added zero items so far. Nice. Carrots go here. Will you donate one? Sure. Uh, that's probably the only thing I can donate. Because that's the only crop I have. <laughs> what about this room? Yes, we can donate a few here. We'll donate a sour puck. And a plumberry. And a slime apple. So we've got three of 13. Cool. I like collecting things. So this is a nice feature. So there's four things to donate. Stone. Magicite. I suppose these are probably coming from my inventory. And that's okay. Now what's in this last room? Ah, we can donate five items here. Pretty good for the first day, I think. Okay. And we'll head out. So this is one wing. So there looks like there's another area over here once we upgrade. Okay, let's head outside. Hey Ash, I'm gonna get to building your house. Hey Melody V, I've been working on a new blueprint that could help you gain more building material. We should talk first thing tomorrow. I can't wait to show you this. Oh, well that's really nice of you. Did we talk to Bubsy today? Bubsy, my friend, how are you? Everyone's on and on about coffee and donuts. Those bland and tasteless things aren't good enough for me. I prefer my herbal tea and grass on toast. Okay, that's good for you. I didn't get my morning cup though. Well, let's go get our free cup of coffee. Say coffee. Um, let's try out this fluffy berry. I can't tell what that really does, but it has some sort of boost effect. So I've got to go make some more. I think I needed more bricks maybe? Or was it wood planks I needed to build Asha's house? 
Uh, yeah, it's probably these wooden planks. We'll build a few. Ooh, got a bonus item. A couple bonus items. Nice. We'll build a few more. Ooh, and we've crafted a hundred items now. Got a new achievement from that. Not too shabby. We'll craft a few fancy planks. Okay, so if we donate two drops, we'll get a two-star reward and gain three rare items. Okay, so should I donate the two drops? Yeah, let's do it. So how do we gain these rare items? And what does what goes back here, I wonder? Okay, um, let me try making some more planks and see if I get a rare item from that. I got a bonus item. Okay. Out we go. And I'm going to upgrade this area too. So I'm not really sure what it means by gain rare items. But we've upgraded it. You know, we make some more plain bricks. I probably should head to the mines, but it's getting so late. I don't think I'll get a lot of mining in today, so no, we will not head to the mines. And hopefully I spoke to everyone. So Dalton's house. Yeah, we can put it in a little... We'll have a little neighborhood right here. Dalton... Not Dalton, Ash's house. Do I have everything I need? I do. Perfect. And let's go check out his house. Ash, where are you? Oh, you didn't come to visit. Okay, well, let's go ahead and get him a desk. There we go. Let's see what kind of stuff he wants. He wants a furnace bed. And he wants to be close to the smelter. So we'll have to keep that in mind. We want one bookshelf. Can I build bookshelves just yet? Ah, let's give it a try. No, I don't have any bookshelf recipes. Okay. I might as well head to bed now. It is pretty late. But we'll collect this weed. Did I collect my carrots? Maybe I should go collect my carrots. Oh, and we should also say hello to Dudley. Hey Dudley. Hey Melanie B. You've been checking your personal goals at your desk inside of your home, right? If you haven't, build yourself a desk yet. I highly suggest you do. Oh, it just so happens I already did, but thank you for the advice. Okay, let's see if we can harvest all of these carrots. Ah, we did it! Just in time. So we will go ahead and head to bed. Hopefully I didn't miss anyone today. To bed we go. So we got level up with Lilith there. And farming is leveled up, crafting is leveled up. Nice. And Sunday day 21. Mad chickens. What does that mean? Ooh. We have chickens in our town square. I wonder if we can buy chickens now. That would be pretty cool if we could. Let's go check out these mad chickens. The chicken travelers are looking for a new place to start their colony. What? What do you mean not in my town? They're travelers? Maybe I have to build something special for them to be able to do that. 
So I got a letter from Dudley. I got five letters in total today. One eggplant. We'll take that. And a blueprint for eggplant crops. We'll have to plant more stuff, I think. Got a fancy plank from Willow. 52 drops from Ash. And heroic merit from Lilith. And DeLuca coins from Laura. I'm not even sure what the DeLuca coins does. And got a bunch of two drops. 240. Nice. Hello, Willow. Whoa, we've been visited by the chicken travelers. I thought the stories were just silly tales. And a compliment for her. Wow, you really mean that? I do. Okay, what are we going to sell today? Maybe we'll sell some uh, bird pieces. <laughs> I don't know if those are going to sell for very much, but, you know, we're selling them. And let's catch this little fish. And say hello to Laura. Hey, Laura. Oh my goodness. Did you see those chickens in Town Square? I love chickens. And, um, I can probably donate some stuff to the museum again, I think. Or did I, I, I think I got one new fruit, right? I and mean, one new crop. Let's go say hi to Ash. Hey, Ash. I haven't told anyone this, but I'm kind of afraid of chickens. They just creep me out, okay? Their eyes are too open or something. I mean, I don't blame you. I don't interact with chickens on a day-to-day -day basis, so I can't see that for sure. Ah, got a flutter by. And the orange feather. Hey, Bubsy. Chickens are the inferior bird species. Therefore, I do not care about them. They're dirty. Have bulging eyeballs. Make annoying sounds, and I dislike them. Well, that's unfortunate. And Willow. Woohoo, it's chicken madness today. I've always wanted to chase chickens around and catch them. Ooh, I bet I can capture one with a ring of fire spell. Please don't do that. Just leave the poor chickens alone. Let's go get our morning cup. So, let's check out the candy brew. Is that for fishing? It looks like it's for fishing. So maybe we'll go hang out with Dudley. But let's say hello to Dalton. I don't trust those chickens, you know? They look like they want to take over Littlewood. Should I get my sword just in case? We can do a battle like old times. Please leave the chickens alone, they're harmless. Hey Dudley, I had plenty of chickens on my old farm. Do you remember them? They used to chase you around. He once came to me crying because one pecked you. I don't remember. But let's hang out with Dudley. Oh, are we going on an adventure? Yes, we are. We'll collect these items first, though. And it looks like Dudley found some dew drops. Let's go do some fishing, if there are any fish to be found. I wonder if I can take hang out with people and go on the air balloon at the same time. I might try that. Oh, there's a bunch of fish over here. Okay. I can't catch it from that vantage point. Now we're from there. Okay, let's try right in front. There we go. Another minnow. I'm not getting very much good stuff. And I missed that one. Okay, that's fine. Maybe I should plant some new crops up here. Maybe I should make this a garden area up here. Yeah, let's try doing that. Let's plant some more crops. Hopefully, Dudley doesn't mind us planting crops. So we can plant eggplants. We need level 25 in farming. So why did I even get the recipe then? I can plant flowers. Um, what about trees? 
plumberry trees, the sour patch tree, and I can plant the stumps. So let's plant some stumps so we can harvest them. <laughs> that should be good. And I need level 20 in gathering. Oh, why do I have the recipes if I can't do it yet? I can do a plumberry tree though. Let's place one here. Oh, maybe I'll make a little orchard area. Not right now though, because I don't have enough items to do that. Okay, let's say goodbye to to Dudley. Thanks for joining me, Dudley. And let me say hello to everyone. I think we did. So let's head over to do a little mining. Did I say hello to Ash? I don't think so. Oh, I did. I did. He's afraid of chickens. No, I haven't figured out how to interact with those chickens yet. Maybe I should do that before I head anywhere. So how do I get these chickens to move into my town? Why wouldn't I want chickens to join my town? So how do I earn points? Welcome to Chicken Madness. Catch as many chickens as you can and bring them back to town square before the timer runs out. What? Um, yes. I almost missed out on this. How do I catch them? I got one. Got another. Can I collect more than one at once? I wonder. No, one at a time. Okay. Oh my gosh, I'm almost out of time. Ah! Only 17 seconds left. There's no way to get all of these chickens. It's simply impossible. Can we get one or two more? Come with me, chicken. I think that's the last of it. Okay. Well, I got five points. So I got three eggs. I wonder how often I can get this chicken madness class. Well, I'm so glad I read that sign before I left town. Let's go actually see what's available in the shop. So this is a tavern. I'm not going to make anything. And... Okay, so we can purchase stone. Wayfarer bed. 350. That's pricey. A solemn clock. I wonder if anybody wants these things. A wayfarer bed. I think I'll purchase that. And maybe I'll purchase that too. Just in case I have need for it. Okay, let's go do some mining. Or do I want to get wood? Let's go to the forest. And we'll jump on our willy gig friend. Okay, so I need, oh, is this a new tree? What is this tree? Golden wood. Oh, we need more of that. But there's a treasure chest here. Got 40 jute jobs. We'll gladly accept that. And some magic wood, another golden wood. Another golden wood tree. Okay, we need to keep an eye out for the for the baddies though. Okay, is there anything else new here? Any more golden wood? Okay, no, just more regular wood now. I mean, I can use regular wood too. I'm probably running pretty low. I'm gonna head back over and collect the magic wood.
can... Thankfully no baddies showed up. Maybe I should catch them these fish. There is a lot of weed also to catch. What is this fish? I got a twig. Okay. <laughs> and let me collect that weed. What is this rock? Just regular rock. And I probably should head back and actually get to bed. Let's try one more fish. Uh, just a minnow. Okay, let's leave the forest. And we'll head back to Littlewood. Should I say hello to these people over here? Hey, Fiona. If you hear a little rumbling while in the forest, leave immediately. You don't want to run into it. Okay. And let's say hello to Olivia. Don't tell the other whirly bugs. But the middle one is my favorite. I can't even interact with that one yet, so it's not my favorite. Back to little what do we go. And I guess we'll head to bed for the night. Hopefully we spoke to everyone. Okay. Leveled up with Willow and Dora. And our fishing skills and woodcutting skills went up. Nice. Well, I think that is it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.